Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on drawing a bar chart. Now a bar chart is an example of a frequency diagram. Now frequency just means how many we have of each thing. So this is telling us how frequent each colour was in our survey when we asked people what their favourite colour was. So how many? So how many people said red? How many people said green? How many people said blue? And basically the height of each bar in our bar chart will tell us this frequency. So here we need to draw this bar chart and notice by the way we have the different values, the different categories here we have as kind of separated values and the bars shouldn't be exactly next to each other, there should be a space between each bar. So we've got three people who liked red, so our bar here which is just a rectangle, should go up to 3 on the frequency axis. So 3 is halfway between 2 and 4, like here, and that's where the top of our bar is going to go. As I said, we need to leave a gap, and then we want our next bar here. How many people said green? Well, it was 10 people, so we should therefore go up to 10. And if you're doing these questions for Dr. Ross Maths, then you will tend to only need to draw one of these bars. The rest will be drawn for you. And then finally, six people said they liked blue, so we need to go up to six, which is up to here. Again, our last rectangle, making sure that there's gaps between those different bars in our bar chart. And I'm just gonna shade them 